so funny? We want people to make guarantees to us, but we're not willing to make guarantees to ourselves. Somebody gave you a guarantee, 30 day guarantee. In 30 days, if you don't make what they told you was gonna make, you got an attitude, you want your money back. But you've never demanded your money back from yourself. You've never looked at yourself in the mirror and said, you let you die. You keep saying you ain't on the next level because of the economy. You keep saying you ain't on the next level because it ain't the season. You keep saying you ain't on the next level because the opportunity ain't there. The truth of the matter is that you ain't there because you ain't there. Have you ever looked at yourself in the mirror and said, I'm not getting up on time. I'm not going to work on time. I'm not putting in 120% when I'm at work. I let me down. And there's some of you, you know what you want, but you are not personally willing to do the work it takes to get it. What you're trying to do is do what you've done on this level and get the next level. You're like, I'm getting up every day. I'm putting in two and a half. I'm putting in three, and I'm not getting the opportunity. The opportunity might require getting up and working out three and a half. It might require you saying no to your friends. It might require you changing your diet. It might require you moving to another city. Whatever it takes, you gotta be willing to do it. And you keep saying you're not there because of something else, because it's easier to blame somebody else. That's the problem with some of you. You always wanna hold other people to the fire, but you're not holding yourself to the fire. You owe you an explanation. You owe you an explanation. You need to look at yourself in the mirror and say, why are you only giving 50%? What's wrong with you? You need to put yourself on punishment. You need to tell you no more TV, no more snacks, no more desserts, no more alcohol, no more, no, we working out now. You need to tell you that you owe you something. We tired of this 60% you. We tired of this crying you, this complaining you. We tired of this version. Greatness is in you, you are here. You here, leave your go go mark. You here, do something. So whatever you gotta do, you do it. And if those of you, you were this close, but you compromised, you let your feelings get the best of you. It's time for you to cut average. It's time for you to cut good, so you can finally get to great. There are no excuses. You cannot cheat success. You gotta work for it. You gotta breathe it. You gotta sleep it. You gotta eat it. You gotta put forth 120%. I didn't get here making excuses. And I stopped being a victim. I stopped saying, I've got to wait for good things to happen to me. And I said, I'm going to grind. I'm going to fight. I'm going to work. I'm going to learn. I'm going to do everything in my power. Every single day, I'm going to do everything in my power to become a victor and not a victim. It only takes one extra push-up. It only takes one extra mile. It only takes one extra rain. It only takes one extra effort. It only takes one extra something to get you to where you're trying to get to. And the goal is, you gotta go a little further than the man who's trying to get what you're trying to get. And can't nobody stop me but me. For some of you, when you do what you do, you act as if you have another opportunity. I'm wired differently. Every opportunity is the last opportunity. Every opportunity, I have to reprove myself again. Every opportunity, I'm still nerd because the day you become content, the day you stop getting better, is the day you die, is the day the person who's trying to catch you will get you. You gotta get this beast mode. You gotta embody beast mode. Everything about you has to say, I to have, I'm gonna get it, and I ain't leaving none of it behind, it's mine.